Hey guys, Andy here, and I've been getting a lot of hate online from my videos for the past several months now, and while it's easy to say, hey, just ignore the haters, or hey, getting haters is the first sign that you're succeeding, after a while, just me making videos just stops being fun. And if you guys haven't noticed, I really haven't been putting any effort into my recent videos because why bother if all I'm gonna get is just a bunch of hateful, ignorant shit. Or just more anonymous, salty Japan expats hiding safely behind their keyboards saying that my very presence in Japan is making the expat community look bad and I should just move back to America and give up. Thankfully, many of the more egregious comments get picked up by the YouTube autoflag system, so no one but me has to see them as I hit delete. But that doesn't stop them from spreading their effluvia elsewhere online, like on Reddit. I've been a digital content creator going as far back as 2004 when I made my first GeoCities website to track Yu-Gi-Oh wins and losses at my local card shop back in Ohio. I know that getting hated online is a hard part about the job, especially when you put yourself out there for only your deepest insecurities to be spotlighted by haters. I've been called far worse online over the years, and while I've been able to withstand it before, it's worn me down to where I just want to shut everything off. And I mean everything. But I know if I do that, the haters win. They'll rejoice in their victory hymn of, and nothing of value was lost, and move on to the new shiny toy for them to do with what they will. I have to sit here and ask myself, nothing of value? The odds of just being a fucking human being are 400 trillion to one. So even if, theoretically let's say, I am the worst most garbage human being to ever have humaned in the history of humans, the fact that I'm even human to begin with is an astonishing win in and of itself. And every little win there just makes the odds even more astronomically astounding. That being said, the only thing I can do now is, well, the same thing I've been doing for nearly 20 years at this point, and that's keep creating. Keep creating when I'm sad, keep creating when I'm happy, keep creating when I win, and to keep creating when I lose. Because it's not just about me, it's about my audience too. Ego aside, I know there's a lot of people out there who've watched my videos and have been inspired to do something in their lives, whether it's to join the military go to Japan to study abroad, or start making content of their own. So, to my supporters, I say thank you, and to my haters, I say thank you. Without the both of you, I wouldn't be where I am today. And, with that said guys, this is Andy, signing for now, and as always, and forever, we'll see you next time. Bye guys.